Put both locks on, make sure it's safe and secure. Thank you. At the Wildlife SOS's Rescue Center in Bengaluru. Let's quickly do a check on Jaura. Jaura, the elderly Bengal tiger, has spent a couple of days recuperating inside the sanctuary's hospital. Okay, let's start putting out the chicken. We're gonna put a couple of pieces of chicken around the enclosure, leading him in a direction towards the gate, which is gonna lead out into acres and acres of forest. The team hopes Jaura is well enough to return to his forested enclosure inside the Tiger Rescue Center, but only if he passes Kartik's chicken test. That will also give us an opportunity to see him walk and move. If we can see him eat that chicken, then we'll know for sure whether the tooth problem, uh, whether we've addressed it sufficiently. All right. Jaura's life here with us is a bit like living in the retirement home. A tiger with injuries similar to Jaura's is really not able to hunt as he once would have. He's not able to dominate the territory that traditionally would have been his. In the wild, they will be always dominated by other males, and they will have some kind of serious fight. It's very likely that he may have been killed by another dominant male in his territory. I guess now it's all up to him. Release the tiger. He's moving. Oh my god, he ran out of there. His mobility has improved better than before. Now at least he is uh, placing the leg on the ground. He's walking more comfortably. Oh, look at him. Here he goes into his pool. He's looking for the chicken. Oh. He took it. He likes yes. that. He took it. He's looking great. He's looking alert and sharp. And he's not wheezing. <laughs> Brilliant, yes. Okay, wow. good. That's amazing. Look at him, he's eating so comfortably. He's eating on the right side as nice. well. I've not seen him eat like this before. <laughs> yeah. He's really chewing, and that I think is a great sign that his dental work has worked. Look at him, I am so impressed. He is chomping and chomping and chomping. That gives me a kind of comfort that he's really showing some improvement. He does seem very relieved. Do you think maybe we should yes. move to the side and then he would be encouraged to come out into the broader enclosure? Yes, I think that's a good idea. Okay. Good. He's kind of following the trail exactly as per plan. And he's heard the gate open and we want to see him walk out of here. He's grooming his coat and his neck just like a little cat only about you know 500 pounds heavier <laughs> that's a sign of a happy animal he's not moving he's coming towards the gate see the forest you can smell the forest all he needs to do is take a few steps and go through that gate he's scent marking see he's sprayed on the tree that means he is really happy because he treats this as a part of his territory He's thinking about the back door, huh? Yes. Yes. He's out in the forest enclosure now. He settled himself down there to finish his snacks. 